Hallelujah, in the name of Lord Jesus Christ, I testify. Hallelujah, from Jesus, Shemin, Zuo, Jian, Zhen. And uh, my name is Annie Kuo, and I used to live in Los Angeles. Oh, uh, I'm Annie Kuo. I was born in Los Angeles. And uh, currently, I am part of Edmonton and Calgary Church in Canada. And today, I would like to testify with you the process in which my mother's God became my God. Uh, my family uh, actually grew up uh, in South America in countries that our church uh, did not uh, exist. Uh, 我的我是來自我的家庭從前是住在南美洲,在南美並沒有我所居住的地方並沒有我們的教會。However, my mother was a True Jesus Church member and uh, therefore even though we didn't have a church, my mom would tell us stories about God. 雖然我所成長的環境沒有教會,但是我的母親是真耶穌教會的信徒,媽媽時常會跟我們講述聖經的故事。and uh, it was only until I was uh, in elementary school that we came back to the United States to live for one year that I was baptized in our church. However, after that we left again and next time we would return would be when I was in high school. 但是在我受洗之後,我們又搬回了南美洲,等到我再次來到美國的時候,我已經是高中生了。So during that time I had a very basic idea of who God was, but I didn't truly know who he was. 因此在那段期間,我對神有略略的認識,但是我並不是真正的認識神。During the time in which uh, we returned, I returned as a high schooler to the United States, God was very merciful to me and uh, granted me the Holy Spirit then. 當我高中回到美國就讀高中的時候呢,神恩待我給予我聖靈。And when I received the Holy Spirit, I did not really understand how important, how essential having the Holy Spirit would be to my life. 當我得到聖靈的時候,我並不明白聖靈對我的一生有何等重要的意義跟價值。uh, not long after we had come to the United States, my mom and my dad uh, had a uh, got a divorce. And it was because my father had uh, another woman, had an extramarital affair. And uh, this was a very uh, hard situation, very uh, difficult, very very messy situation. And uh, that was um, because I got to see how much it affected my mother. Uh, my mother, uh, she is a very wonderful and very strong woman. But after the divorce, I uh, came to understand how um, when a woman's heart is broken, then this person will become uh, extremely hurt, very sad, very um, in great need of help. And uh, when we returned to the U.S. that last time, uh, we were in uh, economical distress. We were living a very humble life. So there were a lot of issues going on at the same time, and uh, many things uh, around me seemed to be very difficult to deal with. And during that time, I felt that all of these problems that I was facing was because of my father's fault. And I felt, or I took it upon myself, that I would need to be the one that would take care of my family from now on because my father had abandoned us. 
。然后我心里觉得说，因为我的父亲抛弃了我们，所以我必须要肩负起照顾家庭的责任。So at the same time, I felt very、uh, betrayed by my father. I felt、um, very wronged. I felt very mad. I felt very sad. A lot of negative emotions. 每当我想到我的父亲的时候，我就想到他对我们的抛弃、遗弃，我的内心充满了愤怒，然后以及许多负面的想法。And during that time, we were already coming to church because we had moved to the U.S. So I would come and I would listen to the sermon and I would also pray and I would also read the Bible. 然后在搬回来美国之后呢，我也有机会来回到教会，就在教会读经、祷告的过程当中。But whenever I heard the sermon that talked about like love your enemies, or when you read the Bible verses that talk about like you should love the people that have wronged you, I felt that it is okay. I don't need to do that because my dad really wronged me very gravely, so it doesn't apply to him. 然后每当我在听道理，呃，学习到圣经说要爱你的仇敌，或是原谅得罪你的人的时候呢，我心里就想说，我的父亲他犯了滔天大罪。不是，他是不值得原谅的。我也不需要为他做任何圣经上面的的道理。And whenever in the Bible says it says honor your father and your mother, in my mind it would be honor your father and mother if they're good. And because my father is not good, therefore I do not need to honor him. 然后当圣当我听到圣经鼓励我们要孝敬你们的父母的时候，我心里也会告诉自己，如果我的父母是好的，我才要孝敬他们。So for many years after this had happened, in my heart, I started building a, a large amount of hatred and resentment towards my dad. So, 就在我父母亲离婚之后的许多年，我心里面筑筑了一座充满仇恨以及怨恨的一个墙。And this hatred in my heart, you couldn't really see it because I would just smile a lot. And when people ask you how you're doing, you say, "Oh, I'm doing pretty good. How are you doing?" So you don't really you don't talk about it, right? 然后，但是这份仇恨呢，是深藏在我心。即便是我能够笑脸迎人，跟人打招呼，态度自若，但是没有人能够看出我心里面那份仇恨。So on one hand, I had the burden of having this much hatred in my heart. 然后有一次，我发现我心里面被这份仇恨给的担子给压得喘不过来。And eventually, this hatred became part of my identity, a part of the like source of energy from. It became part of me. 然后很奇，很特别的是，这份仇恨反倒成为支撑我活着的一个力量。And what I mean by that is that I thought, you know what, my father didn't want me. That is, I thought my father doesn't want me. It is okay. I'm gonna work very hard. I'm gonna study very hard so I can show him how he missed out. Like we, we were not abandoned. He was the one who's missing out on us as. Wonderful children and wonderful families. I'm going to work really hard, study really hard, and do everything the best as I can. So, uh, 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 so, 呃，错过了这么美好的孩子跟家庭。And during this long time period, I knew that having these kind of feelings or having this kind of attitude is not good. I shouldn't be like that. 然后，但其实我内心深处也明白，这样的态度并不是健康的，也我不应该存这样的心态过我的生活。But I couldn't help myself. It was, it was who I was becoming. 但是我却没有办法忍。我却忍受，忍呃，却没有办法停止这样的想法，因为这个仇恨已经成为我的个性的一部分。And I did share some of these emotions with very close friends, but they're good people. They will listen to me, but there's not much that they can do for me except listen. 然后我也曾经跟我的比较好的朋友分享，就是内心深处的一些。的一些故事，然后，但是他们也只能听我说，也没办法帮我什么。And I also started looking for books like those self self help books because I would be considered children of divorce. So I look for books that help children of divorce to overcome all these kind of like bad feelings or not very good attitudes. 所以那时候我也开始去去看一些关于自己情绪治疗方面的书籍，因为我也是属于那被呃离。呃，父母亲离婚之后的
的受害者，所以也坊间有许多的书籍可以帮助我们这一类的人来克服呃心理上面的一些困难。And sharing with my friends or reading all these strategies in these books can temporarily help you or can help you identify or, or give it a name to what you feel or how you feel or why is it that you feel the way you do. 呃，跟朋友谈心，或者是读这些心理方面的丛书呢，是可以帮助我，暂时帮助我来明白说我所经历的情绪是什么。But it doesn't really help you, not not really. 但是，不管是朋友的支持，或者是阅读，却没有办法真正的来帮助我。Because after a very short time period, you think about the situation again, and all that hatred, all that sadness, all that anger comes back again. 因为只要，因为虽然说看完书有有暂时的一个缓解作用，但是不久之后，心中的那份仇恨、怨恨以及愤怒又会回，又会涌到，回到我们的心里面。So by this time period, a couple of years had passed by, and I was attending our church's seminars for college students in YTS. 然后在不久之后，过几过了几年，我参加我们教会的大专班学生大专班灵恩会。And any time during prayers, uh, especially the long prayers, uh, these thoughts would come back again, and I would cry in my prayer because, in all truth, above all the anger, mostly I felt very sad. 然后每当祷告会的时候呢，这些愤怒、忧伤，或者是。No, 仇恨的那些情绪会涌上我的心头，我会一次的、一次次的向神哭泣来祷告。And through all the Bible reading and going to the seminars, God would remind me again and again that this is something that I need to deal with. 然后在每一在每一次参加教会的灵恩灵修会，以及每一次读经的时候，神都不断的在提醒我，我必须要正式处理这内心的负面情绪。And、uh, There were even times or during classes where you learn that that you need to be like Jesus, like Jesus Christ, act like Jesus Christ, you know, do things like Jesus Christ would do it. 然后在在灵修会的时候，总是会常常被勉励说，我们要在言语、行为、心思、意念各方面都要跟主耶稣一样。But my answer was that, well, I'm I'm not Jesus Christ. I'm just a little girl. 但是我心里面的回应却是。我又不是主耶稣，我只不不过是个小孩子罢了。And so, uh, during just during this uh NYTS during the prayer sessions, many many times it came to my mind again. Um, all of this would come to my mind, and I would cry in my prayer, and then I would get up, and it it was it was um it was very burdensome to carry all this hatred within me. 所以每当在像在 NYTS 神训班的祷告会的时候。每一次的祷告都会一次次的去面对这些情绪，然后，然后在祷在哭泣祷告当中，还就是不断的面对，然后但是就觉得说这些情绪对我而言只是一个重担，然后我没有办法去克服。And because I was tired of being so sad, I told God that um I have decided that from now on I want to be a fake Christian. 然后但是我心里面觉得我承担所承受的那一些。忧伤以及痛苦让我觉得我非常的疲惫，所以在祷告当中，我甚至跟神说：“主啊，从今以后我要成为一个伪基督徒。” And what I mean by that is that I'll still come to church, I'll、um, help out in work, I'll look like a good person, but inside I will continue to carry this hatred because I cannot solve it. 然后伪基督徒对我而言就是，我还是会继续在教会的日常生活里面。有好的基督徒的言行，但是在我内心深处，我还是没有办法处理、除去那份对父亲的恨。But God was very kind to me because He knew that you can't be a fake Christian. You can't be just a half Christian. You can't half believe. You need to all believe. You need to all belong to Him. 但是神对我是非常充满慈悲与怜悯的，他知道我们没有办法做一个双面人，表面上看起来是个好的基督徒，但是内心深处却却是充满了仇恨以及哀伤，所以主耶稣就开始要帮助我。And so in one of the、uh, prayers, as I was、uh, praying to God through the Holy Spirit, I was once more asking God why I had this father, why did this happen to me? 
。所以在有一次在圣灵中的祷告的时候，我在地上先询问。神啊，为什么我有如此不堪的父亲？为什么他是我的父亲 ？I ask him. Um, I I told him that of course, typical. It's not fair. I told him it's not fair. I see brothers and sisters that have wonderful families, and I see their children, and I see the interaction between husband and wife, and just it's very beautiful. And ask him why was why did I not grow up in in that family? 我心里面会不断在祷告当中，我会觉得说：神啊，为什么你那么不公平呢？你看看教会里面有多少的弟兄姐妹，他们有好的爸爸，有美好的家庭，而我呢 ？And、uh, and I was asking him whether he saw how much pain my mom was in after this whole situation happened. 我甚至问神说：主啊，你看见我妈妈在离婚之后内心所经历的那些苦楚吗？ And I asked him if he knew how hard it really was. 我问神说，主啊，你知道我们所经历的苦是何等的难受吗 ？And so, as I'm saying, I'm in a prayer session, so I'm actually in the chapel praying. So after asking these questions to God in prayer, I suddenly felt as if I was no longer in the chapel, but I had been、uh, taken elsewhere. 哦，那时候那一次祷告，我是在祷。在会堂里的祷告会里面向神祷告，但是就在我跟神询问以上的问题之后呢，神好像将我带离了整个会堂。So I was still very aware that I am praying among all the brothers and sisters, but at the same time,、um, the the sound of their prayers, I, I I didn't hear them as much anymore, but rather I、uh, I I felt or I saw that I not with my eyes because my eyes are closed, but I felt. That I was、uh, in a very pretty place. It, it was a beach that had a little hill, and on top of the little hill had a little church with a little bell. 虽然我那时候我知道我的肉身是在会堂里面跟弟兄姐妹一起祷告，但是在灵里面，我觉得我的灵魂被提到了另外一个地方，好像是在一个海边的一个海岛里。这个海岛上有个山丘，山丘上面有个教堂，然后我就在教堂里。And、uh, oh, actually, it was in the beach area. Oh, but that's in the beach area. Yeah. And even though I was a college student by then,、uh, I saw myself as a little girl, maybe elementary age. 然后虽然说那时候我的实际年龄是大大专生，但是在那印象里面，我却是一个国小的小学生。And far off, I saw whom I believed to be Jesus Christ sitting on a like a rock area. He's sitting there, enjoying the weather, enjoying the beautiful scenery. And then I run towards him, crying. 然后我在意象当中，我看到一个我觉得应该是主耶稣的人坐在一个石头上，享受美好的阳光。然后我看到了，我就就哭着冲过去找他。Kind of like when、uh, little children run to their parents say, "Oh, did you know this and this happened?" And you know, crying, trying to be comforted by their parents. So that that was me running to Jesus Christ, telling him about all the problems I was having. 就好像是一个受委屈的孩子飞奔到。他的父母怀里面哭诉着说他所承受的那些苦楚，我就是那一个孩子。And as I poured out all of the the grief and the madness and not the madness, the anger and the hatred that I had in my heart to Jesus Christ, I just told him and told him and just asked him so many questions and didn't let him say much. Just asked him a lot of questions like, why did I have this father? You know, why is it so tough? Why is it so unfair? Did you see this? Did you see that? 然后在我，所以我就向耶稣来倾吐我的心事，然后跟神诉说我心里面的不满，然后心中对父亲的怨恨，然后问主说：“你到底有没有看到我们所受的苦？”我就这样子在耶稣面前不断的向神倾心吐意。And it was right at that moment, as I'm asking my million questions, that Jesus Christ embraced me, like gave me a huge hug. 然后当我向主，我将心里面所有的问题都倾倒在主耶稣身上之后呢，主耶稣他就给我一个非常温暖的拥抱。And when you are hugged by Jesus Christ, you are so filled with His love. Everywhere you're filled with His love. Completely, you're filled with His love. 然后当你被耶稣拥抱的时候，你能感受到说你全身从里而外都被神的爱所充满。And you feel that. Know that Jesus Christ loves you so deeply and so completely. You know that that is enough. 然后你会感受到神对我们的爱是非常的深，然后然后是非常完全的。你会觉得说神的爱够了，让我们得到非常完全。你会觉得是一种别无所求的感受。And God's 
love towards me was so deep and so fulfilling and so complete that right after that moment, all the hatred in my heart, all this sadness was gone. 然后主耶稣的爱是非常的对我来讲是那么的深刻是那么的完全然后将我心里面的那一份苦楚那一份苦毒那个怨恨全部都拿走然后觉得就心里面就是只剩下的就是神的爱 and it was to the point that um, that I told God uh, that in the future, well, first thing I asked I asked God is if I could just stay with him there, that I didn't really want to go back. If, if I could stay, I would, I, I would do a really good job. I could help him uh, take care of the uh, the little animals in the sea or something. I, I would be a good worker. I wouldn't cause him trouble. 然后在我在祷告当中体验到神无比的大爱之后我第一个想法是问神说主啊，我可不可以就在这里？不管不管你要我做什么，都愿意就让我留在你身旁，在这份美好里面就好了。But uh, God, God let me know that um that I needed to go back and work, I need to go back to the world and and get some stuff done。但是神却告诉我说，你必须要回到你的现实生活里面来完成更重要的工作。And when I felt His very deep, very deep love i changed from hating my father and his uh, now wife to say to telling god that in the future there's an opportunity i would like to also share with my father and his wife about god because I hope that I can share with my very by then I felt just my father's very poor and very poor. I hope that in the future I can share with my very poor father how good and how gracious you are so that maybe my father will also find joy and peace in, in, in his lifetime. And after having this short conversation, um, the the little bell in the little church in the little hill it rang, and, and uh, God let me know it's going to be time for me to go back now. 然后就在我跟神心里对话之后，不只有那呃印象当中的会堂的的钟声响了，那我也知道我必祷告结束，我必须要回到我的现实生活里。Yeah, and not long after that, the actual prayer bell uh, rang, and so everything ended. 呃，不久之后呢，呃，会堂里面的铃声也响了，所以祷告就结束了。The Four or five years that I accumulated all that hatred, all that revenge, all that resentment, all these bad feelings was completely healed, completely solved in one prayer. And uh, that, that special prayer for me happened only 10 years ago. But every time I remember how deeply God loves me, I'm just very grateful to Him for the mercy He showed He showed me. 虽然这个神治疗我内心伤口的祷告是在十年前的一次祷告，但是这些年来，每当我想起这份祷告的时候，就能够感受到神再一次的感受到神对我的大爱。And it is because He truly healed something. That nobody could see or nobody could really understand. And even though I had so many questions and he didn't answer any of them actually, but he just reminded me that he loved me so much. And knowing that was enough for me to not need to know these answers. 雖然我像神, 投呃投诉了上万上千万的问题，神一个问题都没回答。但神让我明白说，光是他的爱就足够了。那他的爱大到让我不需要去为我的问题去寻找答案。
So after that prayer, um, I really experienced how essential, how important, how true God is, and how important His Holy Spirit is in our lives. So, in that time, I felt that God's Holy Spirit is very important to us. And it is the most important thing in our lives. It is the most important thing in our lives. Because it can completely heal and comfort us, um, regardless of what kind of um, situation or hardships we may have faced in the past. Because God's love, God's power, can help us to heal our past wounds. And so after that prayer, um, I I was able to uh, contact my dad and talk with him on the phone nicely and ask him how he's doing and how's his wife and you know if he needs anything that he can send from here. 所以就在那一次祷告之后呢，我开始会打电话向我父亲请安，跟他嘘寒问暖，然后问候他以及他呃他的太他第二任的太太，然后问问他说你是否需要从美国寄任何物资给他们。And if it truly wasn't for God's mercy upon me, I don't think I would have been able to do that. Not really. If it wasn't for God's mercy upon me, Oh, okay. So I'm not going there tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow. On Tuesday, yeah. Okay. Okay. So this is ten years ago. So what happened? So now, 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 呃，能够拜访我的父亲的动力是来自于神的大爱以及神的恩典。And that's because he and his wife have decided to get baptized in our church, our church. 因为我的父亲和他新任的妻子要在我们教会洗礼，成为基督徒。嗯， so in Ecuador we do do not have a church, but we have a small congregation, maybe around the ten people, fifteen people, maybe. 所以在厄瓜多那里，我们教会的信徒人很少，大概十十来个左右。And、uh, in September they're gonna have a special baptism, and they're gonna baptize around ten ten new people, so it's gonna double in size. 然后在九月份的时候呢，他们将会举行一个特别的洗礼，然后在洗礼当中，将近有十位的呃会新要有十位朋友要要接受洗礼，成为。要加入这个新的家庭，所以厄瓜多教会的人数就就马上倍增。And that's gonna be、uh, my father, his wife, and their daughter gonna get baptized. 然后我父亲，然后他的新任妻子以及他们的女儿将要在这次洗礼当这次的机会洗礼当中接受洗礼。So I am、uh, I am very humble. I'm very grateful to God for showing so much mercy and grace to. My family, myself, and now my father, his family. So, in the face of God's grace, my family, myself, and And this is the God that exists in our church. 然后让我们能够在神的家里，我们教会里面再次团团聚。So may all the glory be unto our God, the Holy Name. 愿一切尊贵荣耀归给天上的真神。Amen. Amen. 啊，对不起哦，我们这个不小心。